Hi, I will now make a short overview on my car rental web app. To deploy this project, you will need a MySQL database and uh, Mavon pre-install. In MySQL, we will need to create create database car rental. Let's check that it is created. Yes. Let's check out from my repository. We can go to web car rental repository and check out from here. I am using IntelliJ IDEA checkout system. So I click checkout, GitHub, put the link, and now we can start our app through Mavon just by using these instructions. Let's go to terminal and put here our text. You should have an administrator rights to have no problems with login file. As you can see, it is already deployed. So we are going to localhost. It is bilingual web app that uses English and Russian version. Also, it is working with sessions and cookies. This web app is also using Apache tiles. You can find in the tiles definition of pages. Uh, it is distributed between header header, footer and menu that you can find in layout. It is also uses libs that are connected in lib bundle and the template as a template for other pages. Uh, all body content you can find here in GSP. Bootstrap is pre-configured pre on this temp template GSP page. On startup website web app will create database from base creation properties. Here you can see these properties. It will go to controller, main servlet, and uh, in init, it will uh, launch DAO init destroy function. DAO init destroy. In secure statements properties, you will find all statements that are not used during init destroy phase. All language configuration is in resource bundle language, English and Russian version. And also there is a login to file. It is a standard Catalina Home uh, logs. So on startup database will be created and filled. Here we can see that tables are created. We can see here orders, cars and users. Project uses strategy pattern. Common factory create a common depending on request in do get and uh, do post. We have big enough command factory. DAO pattern also used here. We have separate DAO for um, all entities. DAO car, DAO order, DAO user and, and DAO factory. Also I have created my own tag, tag select. The difference is uh, in selected attribute that allows to indicate which, which attributes would be, would be selected instead of standard realization. All body is handled in the select tag implementation that created uh, this select tag separately. You will find implementation in search car GSP page. Here is my implementation and alternative for standard select project. As you can see, we in standard realization, we should provide um, new wars, diesel, gasoline for this example. And in this alternative way, we shouldn't create these separate wars. We just can use a standard. Vinutils is used to collect parameters from request, as you can see here. And also it is used to uh, describe our um, entity to cookies. Mail properties is located in separate file and uh, also you can find mail HTML that is prepared by using MailChimp standard uh, mail creation template. Content will be replaced automatically uh, during mail cre creation. Mail creation process you will find in recover command uh, file in this place. Let's start to test it. Go to registration page. Here we can try to register and we will receive error. Uh, 
passwords should match to each other. Also, as I said, it is fully bilingual. First, check, first we check if passwords are equals, so we should make it equal. All fields should be also filled in, so uh, we will receive error if any fields are blank. Now we fill all um, fields, let's test. Yes, we have registered successfully and now logged in. Let's log out and test our email. Go to forgot password and indicate our email. On this page, system verify if we have such email. If not, it not allows us to send emails. Let's put correct email and send it. Covering email has been sent successfully. And let's check it on our email. Yes, we received some email. Yes, we see here our password. As I said, it is bilingual. Let's test it in uh, a Russian language. So we also can put here an email. We cover our email. Check our email. Yes, we have it in another language. Let's go to our search car page to test uh, how it is, how filters is works. Here we can see a page result in, with pagination. Also, it is bilingual. So we can change our language any time. Here we have six pages for it. And now we should we want to limit this, our days with next one. Let's make a search. Yes, we have now only five pages. As we can see, there is no first, second number and no five, six, ten, 11, 12. So let's make a reservation in between these dates for uh, cars 1, 2. Let's make once more any. Here we will be any date. And let's make a reservation of this car. Oh, yeah, I should be logged in. Uh, I will sign in now. Now we can make a reservation. And I won't be able to do it, because between these dates it is not available. Oh yeah, wrong order. Yes, it is already reserved. Let's go to my new orders. It is placed over here. Rent total for this car and our dates. Let's log in as admin. And we can go to his new orders. Here we can see our new order from customer. We can edit it. Now we can approve it. We can add penalty for it. Just to close this order. We will see now in improved orders a new data for this project and also we can uh, close it. Okay, let's close it. It will be in closed orders. Let's log in also as customer now. And in my order archive we will find this order. Let's log in once more as an admin. Only when I provide reason, only then I will be able to reject order. And in rejected orders I will find this explanation. Here it is. Only when we have approved order we will be able to close it. Only we will, when we have a new order we will be able to approve it. Only we will, when we provide reason we will be able to reject it. And if it it is we provide a penalty reason we will be able to add penalty it is done with javascript you can ask your questions below see you